Project. We here at the Amount Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to information, education, inspiration, guidance, advice. And I want to tell another story of uh, Rebbe Menachem Mendel of Kosov. Not Menachem Mendel of Kotsk, somebody else. Menachem Mendel of Kosov. Um, and one day, a machlek is a dispute, came to Rebbe Menachem Mendel of Kosov. Uh, a complaint with respect to a certain choyhit, a ritual slaughterer uh, in their town. And the people came to him and they enumerated a long list of uh, misdeeds and the people asked the tzaddik to relieve uh, the shoichet, uh, to get rid of this objectionable person, remove him from office. But one person had come along with this uh, group of people and he came with the rest, but he disputed the testimony, saying that it was Lashon Hara, it was slander, it was wicked speech, and it derived from hatred. Uh, Rabbi Menachem Mendel considered the matter, and he decided in favor of the shaykhet, in favor of the slaughterer. The people reproached him bitterly because he believed the word of one single person. Here we have a whole bunch of people all saying the same thing. One guy comes along, you believe him? You didn't side with the majority. Let's... And uh, Rabbi Menachem Mendel of Kosov, he says, the scriptures relate that God himself bade Avram to offer his son as a sacrifice, offer, offer him up as a burnt offering. And following the word of God, Abraham prepared to obey. An angel stopped him. Instantly, he heeded the voice of the angel, even though God himself hadn't revoked his command. The Torah teaches us thereby, none but God can command us to destroy a person. But if the very smallest angel comes after the command has been given and cautions us saying lay not thy hand upon we must obey him wise words from Rebbe Menachem Mendel of Kosov we're going to be doing more uh, videos along these lines please come back please watch please learn and until next time on behalf of the Amuna Project I'm Daniel and thank you too much